ni kwani ni personal ni personal sana okay ni personal okay. and ameni kujia It's, it's person to person, person to person. He's talking to you directly. Directly, you know. <laughs> But of course, we have uh, an amazing guest from Siasa Police. Uh, keeping in mind that it's Siasa Mondays, we'd like to just uh, discuss this topic: effects of unemployment and uh, underrepresentation amongst uh, among the youth. And of course, come on, youth man, Pale Inge, we'd like you to just uh, be on standby. We'd like to know, uh, make your comments known as we continue with this conversation, ladies and gentlemen. Put your hands together for this amazing gentleman from Siasa Police. He's called Kimani Njenga. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. It's good to see you in 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 person to make kusema hiyo picha yako ya LinkedIn. Very interesting, right? Slightly older, but then uh you look younger in person. Kindly introduce yourself uh the full detail of who you are and what you really do at uh Siasa please. Absolutely. Uh my name is Jenga Kimani. Mm-hmm. Um my English name is Anthony. I don't use it as much. I work at Siasa please. I am a legal researcher. I am also a policy strategist advisor. Um I also do a lot of legal opinions at the organization. I am also the president of an organization called the All Kenyan Mutkot Competition. Mm-hmm. It's an organization that brings all those sc- all those students together annually to have a discourse on social economic rights mm-hmm. and just contemporary issues that are happening in the country. Uh, we've done it for 11 years we are now preparing it to do it for the 12th time next year okay it's a pleasure to be here and good to see you as well asante ni asante sana and uh, we'll just uh, like to jump straight into the questions mariam absolutely um kimani you you've involved in quite a number of things right um but all of them are a working on focused on the youth and around that space Uh, there is obviously a representation issue when you look at, for example, the average age of our parliament vis-a-vis the average age of like a Kenyan, yeah, which is very young. It's about 19. Um, the average age of our parliament, though, probably in the 50s or 60s, right? What does that mean as far as representation for youth matters um, in parliament and even in the private sector in general? Absolutely. I think we are a country that looks down upon young people mm-hmm. who form the majority of Kenya's population. Mm-hmm. Uh if you look at the statistics like you've just said majority of the citizens in this country are young people what does that tell you that most of the policies that even our legislators make will directly affect the interest of young people but on the other hand we are a country that looks down upon them we don't have adequate safeguards to ensure that they are properly represented which means that their voice or their opinion is not put into consideration mm-hmm. every time we have policies being made every time we have laws being enacted and every time we have all these issue, all these issues going on so i think it's time we started involving young people especially in issues such as direct participation and it's not just a question of ticking the box mm-hmm. and not just that i think young people also need to come out and start participating actively in politics which is what we try to do at Siasa Police telling because we have a lot of ap- apathy among young people mm-hmm. they say we don't care after all um it's 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 not our space you know we've always been put aside for the longest time ever yeah. So I think during like our previous the last uh, election um of course younger people were you know the least uh with the least turnout as far as the polls were concerned right absolutely. and it is how ha- it's apathy um it's also perhaps feeling that um whatever you do there's not it's not going to change anything right so it's like why should I show up to the polls if the if there's no one on the ballot that I feel represents my interest right absolutely mm-hmm. so it's just a question of after all is said and done they'll just get the position mm-hmm. and young people mostly even though in the last parliament we saw a lot of really young people coming and trying and actually some of them actually got seats mm-hmm. we saw a 24 year 24 23 yeah. the woman rep of baringo yes. becoming 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 a, a woman rep which tells you that young people have a lot of potential if at all we create a safe space for them mm-hmm. to thrive in political matters and to make sure that they are represented because like you've said majority of the people are young so we need to have their views and we need to put into consideration what it is that they have to say when we are making policies and when they are underrepresented mm-hmm. that is not taken into consideration yeah 
Yeah. Of course, you can't leave such a huge chunk of your population un- unrepresented. And unemployment is an entirely different thing that we'll get back into in just a minute. But mm-hmm. for now, Skyward is going to be taking over the decks. Yeah. When we get back, we'll continue this discussion about how our young people, um, A, f- figuring out ways to make sure that their voices are heard in the political space and what they can do to remedy the situation. And then unemployment, which is an entirely different monster, I Mariam, think. Mariam, I always <laughs> wanted to ask this question. Yeah. Do we have young leaders or youthful leaders? Because most of the people we, co- we call young leaders mm-hmm. uh, are in their 40s. Are to be 45. Yeah. Where, 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 yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. 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 Mm-hmm. yeah. So that's the question we can also answer when we come back. Absolutely. Skyward the DJ gets into the mix, of course. Let us know what you're feeling about this conversation. Tweet us at NationFMKE, at Mariam Bishar, at Brian underscore C.